Hello, everybody, and welcome back. Fully vaccinated, now in seminar rooms, socially distanced. So let's talk a little bit about the leader like you, Septagon. There are seven skills, from my perspective, to be a great leader. Let's just look at them. First of all, at the top, we have the leader. When somebody walks away from being with the leader, they should feel inspired. Next to the leader is the role of being the manager. That's the tactical tell side. You do this, you do this, we're gonna do this. Then we have inside us the consultant. The consultant knows many things and shares best practices, tips and tools with teams. So the verb here is advise. Moving down the septagon, we have the skill of training your people and making sure that they get the skills and the tools and the knowledge they need. That is the ability to impart knowledge and that's called teach. Then the next skill is the sponsor in us. And this is one that's come up quite a bit during COVID is how do I protect my people, keep them safe, keep them well, watch out for them, make sure everything's going well. Then as we come around the Septagon, we have the mentor in us. The mentor, we share all our experience that's relevant to the people, our successes, our failures, and our learnings. And then we have the last one, which is the coach in us, which is our ability to ask powerful, pertinent questions. And when I have a group in front of me, I put this up in front of the room and I say, what do you think that might be? And some people say, well, it looks like it could possibly be a diaper. And I say, no, wrong. It's not a diaper, it's Now what is it? And people then say, oh, okay, that's interesting. That is looking a lot like a coach. So the question is, how do we get from this kind of coaching in the business and in organizational world to this kind of coach? Going back to basics, what is a coach used for? Or what was a coach used for? The coach was used to take people from A to wherever and the important skill inside the coach, <clears throat> when you would get in the coach, is where are you going? So today when we get in a modern taxi, Uber, Lyft, Grab, or whatever, the first thing is, what's my destination? So <clears throat> a coaching conversation is where you as the leader step in to ask a set of pertinent questions to help them get to their destination. Though the coaching skill is not to tell them what to do, it's simply to hold up a mirror, challenge a company, and be with them. And this is the week of international coaching skills. So I would invite you, as a leader in your Septagon, to lead, manage, consult, train, sponsor, mentor, though ask your people questions, open-ended questions. How do you see this working? Where do you see yourself being? What are some of the things that are working for you? What's not working for you? When you're asking questions, you're sharing with them, we're on the voyage, we know where we're going, we might get there, we might get somewhere else, let's see where we go, though I trust you, I trust your ability. And I would invite you to make coaching part of your leadership septagon to be successful by design, not by chance, to conscious responses instead of unconscious reactions. And with that, Go off and coach your people. Thank you.